Hi, I recently found out that I cannot play my favorite games with my Logitech RumblePad to GamePad, so I decided to change that. Uh, let us see how you can play uh, games like Mafia 2, Mass Effect 2, Witcher 2, etc. with your GamePad. First, you will need uh, a small program. Uh, you have to download the link uh, in here uh, on YouTube channel just down uh, in comment or you can use this procedure. You can use this link on RapidShare to download it, that program. Just go to RapidShare here you can you can see link just here and retype it. Uh, it will direct you here where you can download it from RapidShare servers clicking on download. Uh, we will use option open with WinRAR. Uh, you can download with WinRAR uh, just typing WinRAR in here in Google search and download it and download the uh, WinRAR archiver. So we will use WinRAR and we will open it with WinRAR. Here are free. Now we can close uh, our internet browser. Here are free files you will need to copy. The first and the most important thing after downloading this file is that you need to copy these free files uh, in the game directory where uh, where the game X is. Uh, I will show you this uh, on some example. Here is Mafia 2 game. Uh, here you can see a launcher, but we must put these files where Mafia 2 uh, X is and it is in PC directory. So we will click here and here is here it's Mafia 2. We can go on organize folder and search options view and click here on hide extensions for known file types then apply now we can see it's mafia 2 x just drag and drop these three files as you see i already done that uh, the same procedure is for some other games like uh, here it is Witcher 2, Witcher 2 X uh, is in bin folder so you need to go here find Witcher 2 X uh, and drag and drop these free files as you see here. Uh, no, uh, it's not important which game uh, you do that uh, but the second step is always the same. Uh, you need to open X300 60c.ini file with some text editor. We can use here, we will use here WordPad. Just right click it, open with WordPad. Here you see a lot of a uh, lot of confusing things, so we will just skip this and go the m one of the most important thing here um, is something very easy. Uh, Let's just put down this window and go on start computer system properties device manager. You can get there quickly or maybe using control panel hardware and sound device manager or any other way you are you pl you're pleased. Uh, here you find human interface devices. Uh, you will see uh, the important thing is that you install your gamepad and plug it in before doing this. So now uh, you see here I have Logitech RumblePad 2. Just right click it, properties, details and here in property uh, you choose hardware IDs. This is important thing. Uh, this is the most important part of all this tutorial. You will here see hit with uh, just like here in 
this initialized file x 360 ce uh, so just copy the numbers you see here with 06 046d is in my case in your case it will be something different and just type here with in this uh, in this uh, file uh, after 0x just type whatever it is uh, writing written here in my case 046d uh, the same thing is for PID just write whatever is written there in your uh, hardware ID properties after that just save it and that is that is that is that is basically all you need to do you there is one thing uh, you can do uh, to make your gaming experience easier just uh, double click here on imp x input test and you will see xbox controller if you have done this part uh, uh, right uh, uh, you will see status is written connected you can close it close now in th file and here you see after you press a button on your gamepad you will see which button is that in the game and how xbox 360 game controller uh, see sees it so you can easily change this uh, if you have problems in this step and uh, for some reason when you press the button who on your gamepad corresponds corresponds to a and it e and here on the picture you see it red and not green and b just open x 300 c any again with four pad scroll down uh, where where you will see a b x y uh, a b x and y and here and here uh, you can change the buttons uh, for example i want to uh, my button which i press uh, to be button a now it is button b well i just need to see what is the number beside B the in this case it's free and change it with an A now I save and when I press a uh, B button it's now A that's that is all you need to know just start the game uh, in your options, uh, in game options, choose controller uh, uh, instead of keyboards, uh, and you can play it with your gamepad like you are playing it on Xbox 360. It's the same for Mafia 2, and as I show you for uh, for Witcher 2 and other games, so just find Mafia, just find the game name that exe file and copy that free that three files and do necessary change in any file like here with vid and pid thank you very much